an improbable public display of affection in Hong Kong. Drawing attention all across the city, Chicago native Dennis Allen playing the role of Donald Trump and an Australian musician known as Howard impersonating North Korean leader Kim Jong-un. Let's flip them off. There it is. Look at that. For Allen, it all begins with his tailor-made wig. There it is. More important than me. It's an hour and a half process. First the hair, then layer upon layer of orange foundation. Allen says it's a patriotic sacrifice that is paying off. Well, I was surprised, as surprised as everyone else, and all of, certainly all of my friends and acquaintances are saying that, that I have uh, steady work, of, which is uh, pretty rare these days for a professional musician, uh, particularly in America, uh, anymore. So uh, I'm looking forward to that. You know, we'll see uh, that uh, hopefully this will uh, uh, help me lead to that. Howard takes a similar approach. He takes on Kim Jong-un's signature hairstyle and his trademark jacket before hitting the streets. The Kim impersonator says he hopes to achieve peace with the new U.S. president. Uh, I think he's, uh, he's a great leader and uh, he's much like me, he's, uh, he's a dictator. And I think uh, with that in mind, he's going to turn the United States into North Korea 2.0. So we're going to be great friends. Great friends in Hong Kong trying to show the world that two adversaries can kiss and make up.